some very special recognition. Hey, he's getting a brand new house free of charge, no mortgage included. Our Leah Shiel, she is live this morning in Fernandina Beach with more on his story and his sacrifice. Keitha, this is the second home that Operation Finally Home has built here on the First Coast. This one being in Fernandina Beach, brand new and beautiful. And for many veterans like Sergeant Bradley Thomas, they come home with these physical and mental injuries. And now he gets to really come home to this place. It's going to be his safe place. And of course, this was brought to you by Operation Finally Home and Lennar Homes. Sergeant Bradley Thomas was inspired by his father to join the Marines in 2007 and put on the uniform. I always loved the, the action behind my dad. He was always a man of action, always wanted to get things done, always, you know, very forward. You know, I just saw what it did for him and I'm like, well, I want to be a part of that. Thomas wanted to make it his career, but four years in, he was injured by a roadside bomb. I was in a truck, big boom, truck went up, truck went down. A, I don't remember much about it, honestly. He humbly describes the moment that changed his life. Thomas medically retired four years later, unable to do what he used to do. He came home struggling with more than physical injuries. There was a lot of emotional stuff going on. Um, just, I mean, years and years and years and years of just buried anger. He had PTSD and he struggled until he got a job helping other veterans. He got married and he started saving money, hoping to provide a home for his family one day, thinking it would take years. And yesterday marked 10 years since that bombing. He actually went skydiving the other day to commemorate it. And he says as he was coming down, he could see his brand new home here in Fernandina Beach. It's going to be a really great start for him. Almost a restart, a new way of coming home for Thomas and his family. And they'll be here in just a few hours. Move-in day is today. Live in Fernandina Beach, Leah Shields, First Coast News on your side.